Hermeticism is a philosophical and religious tradition that originated in ancient Egypt and Greece and was later adopted by the Romans and other cultures throughout the world. Hermeticism is named after the legendary figure of Hermes Trismegistus, who was believed to be a wise teacher and master of all arts and sciences. According to Hermetic teachings, Hermes Trismegistus was the author of a series of mystical and esoteric texts known as the Hermetica. These texts contain a wealth of knowledge about the nature of the universe, the human soul, and the divine, and have inspired countless seekers and scholars throughout the ages. Hermeticism is perhaps best known for its emphasis on the unity of all things and its belief in the power of all human mind to understand and control the universe. Hermetic philosophy teaches that everything in the universe is interconnected and that by understanding the laws and principles that govern the cosmos, we can achieve true wisdom and mastery over our own lives. One of the key concepts in Hermeticism is the idea of correspondence, which holds that there are correspondences or connections between all things in the universe. This means that everything in the physical world is connected to everything else in a spiritual or metaphysical sense, and that by understanding these connections, we can gain insight to the deeper mysteries of the universe. Another important aspect of Hermetic philosophy is the concept of alchemy, which is the process of transforming base metals into gold and of transforming the human soul into a higher spiritual state. Hermetic alchemy involves both physical and spiritual practices and is seen as a means of achieving enlightenment and spiritual liberation. Now let's dive deeper into the philosophy of Hermeticism. One of the central ideas in Hermetic philosophy is the concept of the microcosm and the macrocosm. This refers to the belief that the human being is a miniature reflection of the entire universe and that by understanding oneself, one can gain insight into the nature of the cosmos as a whole. This idea is closely related to the hermetic principle of as above, so below, which suggests that there are correspondences or parallels between the different levels of reality. For example, the movements of the planets in the sky are thought to be mirrored in the cycles of life on Earth and the workings of the human mind are seen as reflecting the patterns of the universe. Another key concept in hermetic philosophy is the idea of the threefold nature of reality. This holds that everything in the universe can be divided into three basic categories, the spiritual, the mental and the physical. These three aspects of reality are seen as interdependent and interconnected and each is thought to reflect the others in various ways. In Hermeticism, the spiritual realm is seen as the highest level of reality and is associated with the divine or the absolute. The mental realm, on the other hand, is seen as the level of thought and consciousness and is associated with the human mind. Finally, the physical realm is seen as the level of material existence and is associated with a natural world. Hermetic philosophy also places a great emphasis on the power of the human mind to understand and transform reality. This is expressed in the principle of mentalism which suggests that the universe is fundamentally mental or spiritual in nature, and that the physical world is a manifestation of the divine will or intelligence. This idea is closely related to the concept of magic in Hermeticism, which is seen as the art of using one's mind and will to influence the course of events in the physical world. In Hermetic magic, the practitioner seeks to align their consciousness with the divine will, and to use this connection to bring about positive change in the lives and the world around them. Now, let's turn our attention to some of the key figures, events and spiritual content of Hermeticism. One of the most important figures in the history of Hermeticism is the legendary Hermes Trismegistus 
who was believed to be the author of the Hermetica and the founder of the Hermetic tradition. While it is unclear whether Hermes Trismegistus was an actual historical figure or a mythical creation, his teachings and writings have had a profound impact on the development of Hermeticism over the centuries. Another important figure in the history of Hermeticism is the Renaissance philosopher and magician Marsilio Ficino. Ficino was a prominent scholar and translator of the Hermetic texts and played a key role in the revival of Hermetic philosophy during the Renaissance. He believed that the study of Hermeticism could lead to a deeper understanding of the nature of God and he sought to reconcile Hermetic ideas with Christian theology. The Rosicrucian movement, which emerged in the 17th century, was also heavily influenced by Hermeticism. The Rosicrucians were a secret society of mystics and scholars who sought to promote spiritual and intellectual enlightenment through the study of Hermeticism and other esoteric traditions. Their teachings and practices continue to influence spiritual seekers and occultists to this day. In terms of spiritual content, Hermeticism is known for its emphasis on the spiritual development of the individual. Hermetic teachings emphasize the importance of personal transformation and spiritual enlightenment and provide a framework for achieving these goals through the use of meditation, contemplation and other spiritual practices. One of the key spiritual practices in Hermeticism is alchemy, which involves both the physical transformation of base metals into gold and the spiritual transformation of the human soul. Alchemy is seen as a means of achieving spiritual liberation and enlightenment and is often associated with the quest for the Philosopher's Stone, a mystical substance that is said to grant immortality and spiritual power. To sum up, Hermeticism is known for its focus on the unity of all things. Hermetic teachings emphasize the interconnectedness of all aspects of reality and suggest that by understanding these connections we can gain insight to the deeper mysteries of the universe. This idea is expressed in the Hermetic principle of correspondence which suggests that there are parallels or correspondences between all levels of reality. I hope this has given you a deeper appreciation of this fascinating tradition and that it has inspired you to explore it further. Thank you for watching.